Hey, this is Chuck from Shyrock. I'm here at, uh, at our house in Nashville. Behind me is our garage. This is where we recorded a bunch of the guitars for our record, Everything Burns, um, including some of the guitar parts for the song Still Young that we're going to be showing you today. Evan is inside, and uh, I'm going to show you the guitar rig, all the effects that we use, and um, teach you how to play the song. So let's go inside and see what's going on. We started over. Hey, this is Evan from Shyrock. I'm going to show you how to play the different lead parts from Still Young. Basically, in this song, we just, we're just using this tube screamer, the uh, rat pedal for a couple things, um, these electronics, both of these are delay units, and then sometimes we use this for reverb, I think, in this song. We select all that from here. Um, all of these buttons can select those things. So, for instance, on this setting, number one right here, we have these two on, the uh, TS9 and the 4290. And on setting two, it switches to the other ones, and so on and so forth, and we'll get, we'll get to that. Cool. What do we got for amps here? We got we have a matchless DC30 and a Vox AC30. The intro part comes in after some keyboard parts and a uh, drum roll. And the, the first intro part uses a TS9 overdrive pedal and a TC Electronics 2290 delay unit right here and it sounds like this it's, it's played on the, the one, number one two strings and the, I don't use any other strings at all in this part it goes Without those effects, it sounds like this, actually. So, you can see the difference between that and the effects. And um, the, uh, the second part of the song will be the verse. And the only additions to the, the sound that we use are compression pedal, and uh, reverb unit. Let's go reverb unit down here. Use this Boss compression pedal. This reverb unit, and it simply takes off where that part left off. So it's like. That one is not going to sound as good because <laughs> it's not going to sustain like you want it to, but it sounds like this. So as you can see, it's kind of needs those effects to carry that part. The third part would be the second half of the verse, and for that we use this whammy pedal. <clears throat> also, you leave the compression pedal on. We turn on the, we keep the delay unit on. Sounds like this. And then turn all these things off. Just to give you the simplified version of it. It sounds just like. Then that part we use these chords, an F sharp minor chord. D chord, to an A chord, to an E chord, to an F sharp minor again, to an A, to a C sharp minor. And the next part of the song is just a little walk up, turn around kind of thing to get into the chorus, and just we turn on the uh, the rat pedal and uh, the delay unit again, and it just goes like this: it goes a D to an E to F sharp, to this little A walk up. That's a little octave walk up from A to B to C sharp. And without all the effects, that one sounds like this. And 
the chorus, we use the same um, setting as we used on the intro, and it's just basically playing this part over, uh, basically going over D, E, and A chords, a little walk down thing in the end of it, it just goes, um, <laughs> That time through the, the second half of the verse, um, it's actually a little bit different than the first time. The uh, it just goes through it goes through F sharp minor to D, A, to D, F sharp minor, D, to A, and then D, and then back into the chorus instead of the little walk up right there, it just goes straight to the chorus. This next part is the bridge. And I usually play with a slide and with different effects on it, like so a compressor and, and uh, reverb and some other stuff on it. But I'm going to show it to you first clean without a slide, so you can see kind of what the slide and the effects make it sound like. And here we go. It without this, the, uh, the effects or slide, <clears throat> and then with all that stuff, it kind of brings out the magic of it and it sounds like this. similar to the slide part in the in the bridge actually but it's it's a lot uh, dirtier and nastier sound so and for, for that we, um, we actually use the uh, compression pedal the, the rap pedal and the microamp and also the delay unit and it sounds like this <laughs> Then it goes back into the chorus, which finishes up the song. Well, this is Evan from Shyrock, and I hope this has been helpful for you guys.